guys how is it that new home builders are doing really really well in this weird weird turbulent economy that we all see ourselves in uh i can tell you firsthand that transactions as a whole in the resale market has definitely slowed down so anybody that's looking to sell um, they're thinking twice because they got a low interest rate and maybe they're a little reluctant. So there's a little bit lower inventory, which is keeping the prices higher. But I guess there's less incentives for people to buy the resale homes. However, what we're starting to see and have been seeing for the last few months, especially all almost all of 2023, is that new home builders are absolutely killing it. And there's a few reasons why I'll go through with you why more people are opting to buy a new home versus looking for a resale. And what's interesting too is one out of three of those home buyers are first time home buyers. So there's a lot of people coming off the sidelines that are seeing the incentives. The number one reason why people are looking to buy maybe a new home versus a resale home is price cuts. Prices dipped a little or at least stagnated and they're not going to the same rate at the pace the price uh, um, ascension is with resales due to such a lack of inventory, it's possible that new homes will actually end up by the end of the year being cheaper per square foot than a home that's not brand new, which is crazy. Um, another one, rates, interest rates. If you use a builder's lender, oftentimes they have more flexibility to give you a lower rate. So let's say, you know, an average conventional loan is seven and a quarter right now. If they can buy that down to 575 and you're, let's say, borrowing $400,000, a $500,000 new home, and you're borrowing 400, you're looking probably between 350 and a $400 difference in payment by that percent and a half. Uh, that's pretty substantial. Another thing is they're building smaller floor plans. They're not building quite as big of homes and people are okay with that. They're also, most most buyers are not getting as many high-end furnishings. They're getting more of the baseline furnishings. And the number five reason why more people are buying new homes is they're getting help from their parents. That is one of the biggest uh, common denominators of people that are able to afford is they're getting a little help. And with that, maybe down payment, maybe additional rate buy down and whatnot. So, that is the biggest reason. So another reason why the home builders are doing better, if you remember lumber costs, building materials, et cetera, was through the roof uh, like a year, year and a half ago. But those costs have come down considerably. Uh, the labor market, people are still getting paid a lot, but we're not getting as much quiet quitting. There's more people, I think, showing up to work. So we're also experiencing that there's more stability, more consistency. And then with the supply chain not being as held up as it was, you're starting to see the logistics being a little bit more simplified for home builders as well. If you guys have any questions about anything at all, feel free to call or direct message. Thanks.